y'all it's Abby welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new thank you so much for giving me a small portion of your day so today I wanted to share with y'all what we got for baby number two so um, I will link my baby haul from Liam up here because a lot of that stuff we're using for her as well but there are obviously a few things that we still needed so <laughs> I wanted to share that with y'all none of this is sponsored um, all of this was bought with my own money and everything I can I will link in the description so also some of these items I purchased thrifted and some of these items I purchased new. So I will be sure to link everything that in the new form down in the description as well. Okay, so let's start with the thrifted stuff. I'm only gonna mention a couple things. I'm only gonna mention two things that I've already talked about. One of them is we bought an Ergo baby. I got it off of Facebook Marketplace for 30 bucks, but it also came with the infant carrier and insert. So really excited about that. And then this thing I got, this is the Boppy Lounger. I got this at the local mom consignment shop for $15. I think it's normally 35 or 40, so I purchased that as well. It was the only two things I've talked about, so I'm not gonna talk about them ad nauseum. The next thing I got was uh, Le Lex, Fitz Lex Fitzgerald made me do it, and this is this Milky's breast milk tray. So what it is, is this container that you put in your freezer and then you put your bag your milk bags on here to freeze them flat and then you put them in here and they dispense out the bottom so you always use your oldest ones first and the nice thing about this is like I used to put when I was breastfeeding Liam I put my milk in um, on a cookie sheet but that takes up a lot of room in my freezer so or to freeze it flat so I was very excited about this I think I got I got this on Mercari and I got it for let me look I don't remember it's been a while since I bought it $17 on Mercari. So, um, and I paid shipping, but it was cheaper than it would have been with like my Amazon discounts and stuff. So like registry discounts and things like that. So, all right, next thing was another Lex Fitzgerald made me do it. And that is, I bought this Binksy Baby cart hammock. So this thing is super cool. You put it on your, your shopping cart when you go shopping and you can put your baby in it directly or you can put them in it in the car seat, which is how I plan to use it more. But this was something that was really frustrating with Liam was, you know, I'd put his car seat in the cart and I would have no room for groceries. And so with this, you put this in there and then they have, you have plenty of room underneath for groceries. So I got this off of Poshmark for 21. Yep, $21. All right, so I think that's everything that I have to show you. There's a couple of other things I wanna mention as well that I got that I thrifted but I can't, I didn't bring them inside. So um, the other big thing that I wanted to mention is I got a noggle. So if you're not familiar with a noggle, it's a tube, <laughs> uh, basically, that connects to your clips to your car vent, what's wrong one, to put air in the back seat. So I don't have vents in my back seat, so that's perfect, and but I'm already using it for Liam, so that's why I can't show you, but I'll put it up here. And I wanted to get the white and gray trefoil one, and then I was able to get the black one for, I think, $15 off of Mercari, and I was like, okay, I need to be, oh, $14. <laughs> it's like, all right, I need to be practical here and go for the one that I can get, and also black is probably better. Okay, so then everything else that I'm gonna talk about is stuff that I bought new. Most of this stuff um, came from Target or Amazon and there's Amazon stuff that I need to order that I'm going to talk about as well But you can totally tell she's the second kid just by the kinds of things that we bought that I bought <laughs> but um, Our big 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 ticket item is we bought the Owlet Smart Sock 3 and then we also bought a camera I got the set at Costco for like $300 and the outlet offered me so much peace of mind when I was pregnant or when I had had Liam and so I really wanted to upgrade to the new one because it's really easy to use. And then the camera is actually in Liam's room right now. <laughs> so uh, we're using it, but this, it's, it's spendy, but in my opinion, the outlet is worth it, especially for the peace of mind that it gives me personally. So we bought a new outlet. And then this I bought off of Amazon. Um, this is by Well Avila. It's one of those many, you know, Chinese brands that's popped up on <laughs> Amazon. Um, but this is a diaper bag. I decided that since I was gonna have two under two that I needed a backpack. So I bought a backpack. 
Um, this is the I, this was the cheapest version of it I found. It's obviously available in lots of versions, but it's this really cute gray backpack. It's got um, carry straps at the top, and then on the shoulder straps, it actually has straps to clip it to the stroller, which I thought was awesome. It has pockets galore, um, and uh, the reviews on it were really good. People said that it held up really well. It was good for two under two, and uh, it comes with a changing mat as well. And then I don't know what this is. What is this? Oh, a burp cloth, cute. <laughs> Came with a burp cloth. Um, so I'm gonna leave that out so I can put that in the wash. But anyway, I. And this also came with a pacifier holder. I really liked how this one looked and I felt like it was a good compromise because it was something that I felt looked really, really nice and kind of chic, but also wasn't girly so Ben wouldn't fuss about carrying it. So uh, I got this because it was on sale, just like a general like prime sale, not prime day, but just a prime sale for $27.99 I think. And then there was an additional coupon and I had a gift card so I ended up paying $4 for it out of pocket, <laughs> which is way cheaper than I would have been able to get it with my registry coupon so i'm very excited about this and actually i've had this for a long time and i've been waiting to film this video so i could actually like transfer all of our stuff into it and start using it so very excited to give that a shot okay so i think everything else uh that i have to physically show you is from target so i'm just going to mention real quick the things i need to get from amazon i'm waiting for some of my fetch rewards uh gift cards to clear before i place that order we're getting another white noise machine because Liam still uses his. I'm getting another set of diaper covers as well as a couple of sets of inserts because some of our inserts are worn out and I wanted to get some lighter colored diapers. And then I'm also buying a ton of diaper liners because I can get them for 15% off because I did make baby registries specifically so I could get the free welcome gift and the coupons. Uh, and then I need to get another sleep sack in a size small. We need a new changing pad for our changing table because ours is toast. I'm buying a cover for this and I'm gonna, I have all of the, I'm gonna be showing you guys like cutaways of all of this. And then I'm buying a new snot sucker because I talked about that with Liam. I, that's something I will replace with every kid. The one that I got this time doesn't come in half but the end opens up. So that was enough for me. I was like, I can clean that out very well. That makes me happy. Okay. So now everything else I have is from Target. I don't really have that much, honestly, uh, because again, she's a second kid. So I tried to thrift as much as I could, but this item I tried and could not get, and that's the Bricka, Munchkin Bricka, Bricka car seat protector. I have leather seats in my car, so um, we have one of these under Liam's car seat, and it's worked really, really well, having taken his car seat out and being able to see underneath the seat. So the seat underneath, rather. So I bought another one of these, and then I bought two of the go by gold bug car mirrors one for my car one for ben's car um we are not buying a new car seat um our car seat is still well within date and it was never we were never in an accident or anything so it never went through a situation that would invalidate it so we decided we're not going to do that so we might be getting one more car car seat base because what we did when we had liam was we had a car seat base in every car but we have now since gotten another car. <laughs> so we might get another one. I haven't, we haven't decided yet. I just realized my necklaces are super wonky. Hang on, let me fix those because it's gonna drive me nuts. Okay. So I bought two of the car mirrors. Um, next thing I got was I bought this Safety First Simple Scan Forehead Thermometer. People said this one worked pretty well. Ours was terrible so this one now this one is only temporal it's or forehead it's not in ear so but it had decent ratings it's safety first so it had pretty good ratings so i thought we'd give that one a try because ours was awful i bought one from amazon and it was really it was crap so okay um let's see last two things um i bought a new bottle brush because ours has been sitting out on the counter for two years so <laughs> I thought I should buy a new one and they're three dollars and then the other thing I was really really excited about this so I bought a couple of different car seat covers when we had Liam and one of the problems with the lighter weight one which is what we need now um, is that it has a hole in the top and people would look in the hole at the top and felt like that they could get close. And I was like, no, I'm not okay with this. It also didn't last very well. It's got some holes in it, things like that. 
And so I saw this Bebe Ole, which I looked up how to say it, so I know I'm saying it right, uh, car seat cover that's like, it clips to the handles and then it covers the car seat completely. And I was like, oh my gosh, I want one. And it's muslin, so it's super lightweight. I was like, this is what I want, this is perfect. And there was this pattern that I saw on uh, from Target and it's this black and white leaf pattern. And I was like, oh, that's really pretty, I want that one. So I added it to the baby registry. And then one day I was at Target and I saw this like container sticking out like this. And I was like, oh, that's the brand of the car seat cover I want. I was like, oh, maybe it is the car seat cover I want. And, or cause I saw this part right here. And so I was like, oh, well, it's on, it's $34.99 from Target's website, but then it was on sale for $24.49 cause it was an online exclusive item. And so I was like, yeah, okay, cool. If it's a pattern that I like, I'll get it, even if it's not the pattern I want, because it's so much cheaper. It was the pattern I wanted! <laughs> and I got it for way cheaper than it was online. And I did the math, so it was like way cheaper than it would have been with the registry discount, because y'all know I'm all about saving money. So I actually have had this for months. <laughs> I think I bought this in January. <laughs> so I've had this a really long time. Um, Cause that was the other thing was I thought like the leaf pattern would be gender neutral enough that it would work either way. So I believe I saw Ashton O'Malley was who I saw this, she had this. Um, so anyways, it stretches over the car seat and then it hooks to the handle of the car seat. I actually need to try this and make sure it fits on our car seat. And um, yeah, I'm so excited about this. I need to wash this cause I need to take this to the hospital. Uh, I need to wash it so I can put it in my hospital bag. But other than that, so anyways, I was like really, really, really excited about that. So. I hope y'all enjoyed this mini, not mini, but this baby haul. Um, that's everything that we've gotten for baby number two. There's one other thing I'm considering and I'm still trying to decide. I am considering getting one or two, I haven't decided, of the LV pump. I, given that I have a toddler, I feel like having, and I want to pump more than I did with him for several reasons. And so, I don't want to have to be tied to a breast pump for 15 minutes multiple times a day. So I am very strongly considering the LV. I don't know. I haven't decided. I've been watching reviews on the LV and the Willow, both. I just haven't decided if I'm going to commit to spend that much money because it's not cheap. So if anybody seeing this has used one of those, pardon me, I think I've, let me know down below. But yes, that is everything that we bought for baby number two. I am 36 weeks the day I'm filming this, so hopefully she's coming soon. Uh, her daddy has been on business travel and he will be home either Saturday or Sunday, depending on how travel works out. So after that, I'm good. I'm ready for her to be here. So uh, yeah, uh, I will um, do my best to update y'all on Instagram. So I'll pop my hand on the screen. It's also always linked in the description. I will do my best to update you when she is born. I make no promises, however. Um, um, you guys know, if, you, if any of you follow me on Instagram, you know that I'm terrible up, about updating my Instagram anyways. But I will do my best to keep you in the loop as to when she arrives. And I hope y'all enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye.